<laughs> so much treasure. Hey, Zash! Huh? Oh, you finally got here. Yeah, while you were in there, I found my family treasure. What are you doing by my box? Uh, what are you talking about? This chest was empty when I got here. What? I said it was empty! Welcome back, heroes, to some more Skyrim. So last we left off, we finished up the fifth gate and got quite a lot of money from it. The 20k and all those gems. Shiny, shiny gems. I don't know what I'm going to even do with it all. Torlock, where are you going? I think he's a bit confused on how the steps work. Well, anyways, I think it's time to go ahead and, you know, see what the old grandpa's at the top of the mountain have in store for us because I kind of want to get the shouts going but more importantly I want to get the dragons going but you know having a good old Fusro Da wouldn't be all that bad now would it so I just I guess I just gotta make my way up I, I've been up this once before in a quest uh, I don't know oh well I'm right there yeah so, there we go. I just uh, need to continue walking up the steps there. Oh, look. This is uh, the last thing up there. If you guys want to see um, in, in tablet. For all, all for years, all silent, the graybeard spoke one name, Tyva Septon. Septum, stripling then, was summoned to Hothgar. They blessed him and named him Dover King. That's right, Tiberial Septum, the first, well, I, I think it was the first Dova King. Uh, well, uh, yeah, if you, if you want to know of uh, all those things, I'm sure there's, uh, what's this, a chest? Yeah, whatever. It's not like you're, oh, I'm very cold. Okay, let's go inside. Hi, Hothgar. Hrothgar. I like saying Hothgar because it seems to work. Hello? You were shouting at me. I was told to call, talk to someone here. Do I talk to you? Yeah, you just bowing to me. So, oh, there you are. A dragonborn appeared. Yeah, where's my drink? In the I was promised a drink. Candy? Candy, candy will do as well. Uh, I answer your summons. Because I was promised candy. Show us, Dragonborn. No. Let us taste of your voice. Uh, you know, that's, that's a little bit suggestive. Oh, you mean you want me to shout at you? Oh, okay, I, I gotcha, I gotcha. Hang on, I don't even think I have this keyed. Uh, let's see here. Uh, unrelenting force. And, ha Yeah, like it? Huh? Dragonborn. It's more where that came from. Welcome to High Rothgar. <laughs> yeah, man, these guys are old. I am Master Angi. An Anigi? Okay, Master Anigi. <laughs> tell me, Dragonborn. Uh, Why have you come here? Why? Because I want to do some sweet uh, shouting and stuff. Uh, I want to find out what it means to be Dragonborn. I'm here to guide you in that. Because, you know, I'm already a, a Super Saiyan who, who can transform into a werewolf who, who knows ninjutsu and, and has learned various sword techniques. <laughs> Why not? A, oh, yeah, and don't forget magic. Uh, wait, you mean I'm not the only Dragonborn? You're not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift. Oh, so what you're saying is I'm not special. Well, you are the only Dragonborn of this age. <laughs> That is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. Hmm. That is all I can say. Okay. Yeah, I've had a lot of skeletons shouting at my face. That or oh, them dragonborn. <laughs> uh, I'm ready to learn. You have shown that you are dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. Yep. But do you have the discipline and temperament <laughs> to follow the? Not really. <laughs> Come on, do your mumbo magic and just teach me stuff. Training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a doom. 
Oh, sorry, I thought you wanted me to do that. <laughs> when you shout, speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn uh -huh. words of power. Uh huh. All shouts are made up of three words of power. It's you! As you boost! Sorry, you're, uh, you're, you're, you're talking in my face made me sneeze. <laughs> A second word in unrelenting force. What are you doing, t Tarlock? G get, get back. Go, go, back. Get back. Force to focus your thumb more sharply. Hmm? Oh? He's doing some magic. He rode into the ground. He he's graffitiing. <laughs> the old I didn't realize these old guys are actually into graffiti. Oh, balance, unrelenting force. Sorry, I can't hear you over the loud noises. Mm-hmm. Well, that is how the rest of us learn to shout. Mm -hmm. As dragon mm -hmm. learner, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. Yep. As Did that. It was tasty. Master Einar will <laughs> allow you to tap into his understanding of rope. No. Ah, no, I'm absorbing an old dude's soul. I feel icky. Okay. That work? Huh? Use your unrelenting no. Shout Apparently, I didn't do that at the right time. Okay, Torlock, you're gonna be my guinea pig. Oh. Nope. Boost. Using Torlock. <laughs> okay, just stand right there, Torlock. I'm just gonna wait for them to summon yet another thing. They're summoning ghosts, Grandpa's. Again. GG's. <laughs> Them old GG's. Alright. Stand still! You know, this still feels incomplete. I think I can learn a third word, and maybe this would be a little bit better. Just saying. Oh, I missed. What's up? He just disappeared. What is this? Did you eat him? You should stop doing that. What have I told you about eating random souls? Huh, Torlock? Well, take that! Good, Torlock. I'm glad you don't ever get pissed off. Your thumb is precise. You show great promise, Dragon. Thank you. I'm a, I'm a Saiyan, by the way. Just, just want to put that out there. Follow Master Body. Master Body? Bore, Boris, what words do you have? What words of wisdom can I rip from your brain? Not, not necessarily physically, because apparently that's not how it works. Believe me, I've tried. Can't learn anything just by ripping their brains out. So, where to, Boris? Oh, we got a gate. <laughs> oh, no, I remember this one. I actually probably have a technique which would be even faster than their shout. You all look really cold. Who's talking? Huh? What? Oh. There's words. You graffitied the ground again. What? Ah, man, they're so quiet. Okay. Oh no! Who is why you do this? <laughs> ah, I feel dirty again. Whirlwind sprint. It's a magic whirlwind sprint. We'll see how quickly you can master a new shot. Well, faster than you can walk. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. Okay. I guess we gotta get in line for this ride. Um? He can fly! 
quarry will open the gate. It's use your will this, and strength to find Does this let me fly? Alright. Let's do this. Go! I didn't fly, I don't think I did it right. <laughs> Uh, he's har he's harnessing the power of the space weedle. Oh no. Your quick mastery of a new thume is uh, astonishing. Yeah, you know there is a another the thing called oh, I don't know magic that people could do. It's, it might be a little bit better. I don't know. I don't know. It's just my opinion. <laughs> Thought it was easy. This is easy for everyone. I don't know how I do it. it just happens. Uh, let's see. Uh, man, I don't have a smart aleck thing to say. I just want to say, of course I learned it. It's it's just the power of the Super Saiyan. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jurgen Windcaller, our founder, what? from his tomb. You want me to retrieve a horn? Ugh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, thanks, guys. It's up me. A little bit. Uh, I'll get that horn on us one day. We'll get there. <laughs> Actually, uh, what I'm wanting to do is I have another mod that I have incorporated, and I'd rather do that first. I forgot that there was actually a full quest after this. I was just hoping that I'd get, you know, the whole Fus Roda. But apparently not. So what we're going to do is we're going to eat and then we're going to travel to the place I had planned. Okay, so for the particular mod I have planned retrieve. Oh, wow. It is actually really close to there. That is very convenient. But uh, yeah, you'll see once we get there. We're just going to fast travel to the stables and then take it from there. Okay, Mr. Stables, we're going to Mothral. Mothral? I, I, I can't remember what it's take called. Me to, take me to the place I want to go. Mothral. We'll yeah, that that place. Uh, I'm sure I'm not too overburdened. This will probably be easy enough. And you guys will see what I have planned. Okay, we're here. Oh, what's going on in this place? Yeah, who cares? Just the affairs of the humans. Who really cares about them? <laughs> so, the place that... Um, uh, the rain turns to driving snow and wind. Okay, so at least it's not wet anymore. Ah, those are good. Uh, who is... That. You are. If you stand mm -hmm. before me to accuse me of sacrificing children or eating the hearts of the dead, <laughs> you may save your breath. Uh. I have done no such who thing. Who are nor you? Do I intend to. I simply wish to live my life in peace. <laughs> Somebody's mad. So then, what do you do? I keep to myself. Okay. I offer spells and scrolls to those oh, he's who a mage. Them, and wisdom in conjuration magic for those who wish to learn. <laughs> Beyond that, I seek only to be left alone to pursue my research. Well, I do magic. Uh, so what can you tell me about the area? What can you teach me about conjuration? You deal with powerful forces. Take care they do not overwhelm you. <laughs> Oh, okay, so he can teach you conjuration, that's fine. Why don't you set, set up a shop? Anyone will tell you Morthal can be a dangerous place. Hmm. My talents are useful here. Yeah, I don't care. Help maintain order. <laughs> uh, he just seems to have a bit of an issue. If he's whining so much, he should just burn the place to the ground if they give him that much trouble. That's what I would do. Burn it to the ground. So, the place I'm going to does suggest that you bring a companion to go with you. Uh, well, we got, we got, you know, good old Torlock here. I'm probably going to get my other companion, uh, soon enough. But, as you could probably see, this is where we're heading. The Haunted Mansion. Yes, that's right, if, for those of you who actually know, I think it's also called, it's called the Evil Manor. But it's essentially a place that is based on... 
the ooh, effective against undead that will probably come in handy and we'll get this it is based on resident evil so this is the resident evil manor so we're gonna go ahead and explore what it has to offer uh, anything around I, I don't know how much this mimics uh, resident evil you are damp oh there's things <laughs> Ow, did I get bit? Stop it. Severus. Stop it. Stop it, Severus. Just take your stuff. So, I'm gonna try to refrain from using some of my, like, Super Saiyan powers. Because that is pretty, pretty overpower, overpowering. And since this is not really a horror map, or I think it's a horror map, it might be. Um, it's like kind of a horror map. Or, I guess it was listed under the area, but it's more of a recreation map, so it's it's more gonna be just like Resident Evil fighting things and whatnot. So we'll see how this goes. But from what I heard, it's also <coughs> supposed to be lore friend friendly, friendly. Okay, there we go. Let's head on in. Okay, Manor, what sort of evil things do you have for me? Uh, I guess I could have a firebolt out. Firebolt and sword. Yeah, that's this will be good. Cause the the firebolt. Oh, is that a thing? Okay, let me check real quick. Did I get a horn of the no? That's not what I want. Just seeing if visit the music. No. Nope. Okay, so I think this place is mostly just something that I can explore around. There might be some puzzles and whatnot. But overall, I don't think there's like particularly a quest involved with it. So let's go ahead and search the manor and rid it of all of its stench and then we can claim it as our own. Hello, restless undead. Eh. Ow. Was Am I on fire? You setting me on fire? Red shield member. Ow. Oh! Sorry, Torlock! I might have hit you in the face! Ugh. Ugh. Stop it! Oh! Don't go losing your head now! Might need that later. Ow! Stop it! No! Back up! You're done! No! There we go. Oh, I almost died! Uh, where is uh, my healing potion? I should have that still tied, don't I? Apparently not. Okay, let's just go ahead and get that taken care of. All right, good old rest up. Re <laughs> good. I'm all good and rested up. Oh my. <laughs> right. I think I can turn some of this stuff into silver. I really need to find some quicksilver though. That would be awesome to get. Not to mention I could sell it for a pretty penny. Which, I don't know if I'd need it, but, meh. A wooden warhorn. Okay. I got a wooden warhorn. Now, there are supposed to be puzzles, which means I do need to look out for items. Because they might be important later. There we go. Let's get that. An emerald. Thank you, game. Thank you very much. Okay, well, we're just gonna... Yeah, there we go. Dude! <laughs> so, yeah, it looks like it's gonna be kind of like the game. Because I remember those specific parts. I never actually defeated or completed the game. Ooh, Tundra Cotton. Cotton? Herbalist Bestiary Ice Wraiths. Shh. Sure. <laughs> yeah, I haven't beaten the game, but there are specific areas that I remember. It's barred from the other side. Oh no. I don't know how long this manor will actually take to clear because I know Resident Evil, it's, you know, it's a full-fledged game. And if this is supposed to be like trying to mimic it. Ah, you stupid peck! There we go. 
Yeah, if it's trying to mimic it, that means there's got to be a lot in involved. This... <laughs> Sorry, I didn't expect this kitchen to be so well kept. It's interesting. Ooh. That music. That's... Is that Elder Scroll music? Or is that Resident Evil music? It's, it's familiar nonetheless. Uh, we're just kind of grab some stuff here. Nod mead. Yay. Torlock, you're in the way. Oh my goodness. Ugh. This is why I need Fusorda. So I can get them out of the way. Right. What's going on? Oh, barred from the other side. Okay, so... Uh, I guess we looted all that we can from there. Man, it's been so long since I played Resident Evil, but this is definitely given some nostalgia factor. Uh, you know, I could try seeing if I could leave, but I'm not really that interested just yet. Well, it's the statue thing! I don't remember this. It's like something that you're supposed to push around, right? Mansion first floor map. That's a lot of area. We'll just, uh, yoink. I don't know why we need a map, because, I mean, can't I just, you know, go map? And I have a map? Uh, but it's, okay, so maybe this wasn't the one that you push. I know there's a thing that you do with it. Wait, you could sit down? Okay, I guess that doesn't do anything in particular. All right. I'm hungry! <clears throat> it's just a rotten corpse. <sighs> right, well, let's just go ahead and take care of the food. <sighs> okay. Diabella statue. Linen wrap. Uh, the Diabella statue will be useful. You're, you're currently glutted, thirsty, and sober. Uh, which means I got a bit of a slowness. I was totally expecting that thing to like get up and start attacking me, but I guess it didn't. <laughs> oh well. Well, uh, anyways guys, I'm going to go ahead and call that here. So that has been Skyrim. We'll be uh, exploring through the manor throughout this week. So hopefully there will be some interesting surprises. To oblivion and back, which you shush, Torlock, I'm speaking here. But um, if you guys have anything interesting to say about, you know, the Resident Evil Manor, uh, particular things to look out for, and things like that, let me know in the comment section below. And hopefully this will be fun. Anyways, guys, it's been Zeshin of Here's a Fools, and I'll see you all next time. Take care and goodbye. <laughs>